Hello, this is Toy2, and welcome back to Let's Play Croc the Legend of the Gobos. Why don't I just show off what the main theme sounds like, and here it is. It's amazing. Go listen to it. Let's go. Where are we at? We are... Ooh, what's that all about? That's what I thought. Lair of the Feeble. We got all these done, too, so we're good to go on this. All right, cutscene. You got red eyes, try, try. Red eyes, try, try. Clear eyes, try, clear eyes. Platform, platform. Yes <clears throat> Ten, nice, nice. Oh, just to let you know, when when Croc um, is facing a direction and you press straight, the camera actually does not turn him. So, say for instance, I'm right here. I'm right here. I will go in that direction. So, the camera is not as bad as people think it is. Actually, I'm, I'm dumb. Why don't I just do this? Because that's what that button is for. Like, right there. I could have easily lost that. Yep. That's a very, very, very useful, uh, very, very, very useful it is. We are heading towards our first boss, too. Ugh. Boss stages do not have any gems or gabos. They only have this. This boss just ha- You just have to wait. You just have to wait. Literally, that's it. And make sure to use that shift button, too. Make sure to use that shift button to, to, to get back around to him. Got him. 50 gems. Perfect stage. Got it, got it, got it. And that's our first boss of the game. Pretty simple, pretty simple. Make sure to use the, make sure to use the, uh, the swing backwards. Is that, ooh, it's a special stage. How about that? The Tumbling Dondini. Do we want to do the first one? We can. A special one. We can do that. We can do that. S1, the Tumbling Dantini, but I, I would prefer to do this first. We'll do the special stages after the boss. Alright. Let's not touch him. How about that? Let's not touch that guy. How about that? Go down here, see what we got. We got ourselves. Okay, so the, the super jump is not actually in this game, it's in Croc 2. Which is ooh, the camera's having a fun time here. Look at this. Wow. Ooh. Yeah, the camera's ha camera was having a fun time there for a second. What song will I use? I don't know what song I'll use. I'll use I'll use I'll use a song. Okay, so if we, if we stand here, we got ourselves a secret down here. And we got ourselves another Gobbo. That door's giving me problems. I don't like it when I have problems. What the hell? That was my first honest death, too. Ugh. Not a good start, Toad. Not a good start. Alright. Yeah. Let's 
down there. We got ourselves... Alright, that's where we're supposed to go because the door's down there. This is probably where our last, um... There it is. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Get rid of you. There's another Gaba. We only have four. Where's the fifth one? That's concerning. Is it down there? Yeah, I see it. I see it. It's on that tiny... It's on that tiny little platform. Oh, jeez. And that's why that's there. Alright, what do we got here? Um... I'm just gonna say, do I have to guess? <gasps> I have to guess. No way. I have to guess where that is. I have to go back through and do that. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. Do I actually? Do I actually have? No, I don't want to. I don't want to go through here. I'm not done with that stage yet. Do I actually have to get all the gobos again? I think I do. I think I have to do this whole... I have to do the whole stage all over again. I don't... I, I do not know where it is. Where could it be? Um, uh-oh. That's a bad omen. That's a bad omen. At least it's not a big stage. I mean, let's let's be honest. It's not a big stage at all. But it, it is quite annoying that we have to go through the whole stage again just to have another chance to find out which box might have it. Now, wait a second. I'm going to do a little test before I go back in there because... Do a little test before I go back in there. Yes, you can in you can influence you can influence your movements. So, with that in mind, gotta go in here. So let's see, if I, if I'm theoretically right here, I can go on to the other one. Okay, okay, that's easy. That's easy. Okay, now that I know that, I thought I couldn't influence my movement, I would just drop like a rock. But I was very wrong about that. Okay, now that we have that out of the way, very short stage, you know what you're doing. Like I said, this is my original copy of the game. Okay. There we go. That's what you're supposed to do. Good to know. And it was the first box anyway. And it was the first box. 55 gems in total. We are out of here. We got ourselves we got ourselves our life back too, which is nice. Alright, next stage. Cave Fear. Let's do a quick save. 10% complete. Yep. Next thing. Alright, what do we got here? I'm, I'm gonna use a cave theme now. I'm gonna use a cave theme. Use a cave theme. Ow. You need to die, thank you. Ugh. I could've just... I did jump on here, actually. And 
again, I'm using the keyboard. Get rid of you, you're gonna be... You're gonna be generally annoying, I can tell. So I just get rid of you right now. What'd that do? That brought that platform down right there. Okay. It's not coming back down, lovely. Ooh. The perspective in this game is weird. But you do get used to it after a while. Yay, it's a little friend of ours. Come on. Alright, we're done with this area. Yeah, it's what what a what a what an what an essential move that that um flip yourself backward thing. Very, very, very essential. Okay, now we got this. Follow it over. Alright. Well, that was close. Where's the last of these key? Where, there's this, and then there is that. We're still missing one. Well, there's the fifth one. Now, where's the other gem at? It's probably one of these. It's probably the. It's probably this one. No, where is it at? Where is it at? Yeah, is it? I, hmm. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Alright, what do we got here? Well, we're supposed to go up here, I guess. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch, it happened again, didn't it? redeem myself with that. <gasps> I got it! Oh, wow. I did redeem myself. Get the rest of these. Ah. The controls aren't perfect, like I said. Definitely want to collect as many of these as possible, that's for sure. But I think the best move in the game is uh, definitely this. It works, it is so nice. Instead of having to do this, you want to flip 180 degrees backwards very quickly, then you can do that. And the level. Next level. We are almost at our next extra life. Darkness descends. One six. Oh, but you're definitely right about that. It, it is getting dark, and uh... oh, I love the ba I love the freaking backgrounds in this game. They're so pretty. Now, before we do that, I think we have some. Yep, there it is. Just do that. Do that very quick. All right. I'll just go over here very quick. 
Croc can do this too. We have not done this before. I am prepared to get my ass kicked by this game now. I am oh, here we go. This is our first of these many games. I hate this. I hate it. Let me just say I never liked this mini game. Alright. Alright, we're done with this area. Do a quick overview. Yeah, we are done with this area. In we go. Ooh. Yes, my favorite background of the game is this one. I, I just find it so beautiful. You can hear that creaking sound. Our little platforms that we are jumping on are disappearing. Short levels. They're our first levels. Don't expect them to be really difficult. Go with that. Three of five. I think, I don't think there's a secret over there. I don't think so. Alright, um, we go here. Come on, come on, come on. This game is just pretty to look at. It looks, pr it's primitive looking, but it's really pretty to look at. It's a, it's, it's a classic. This, is, this game's a classic, it really is. It's a little platforming here. that and we're looking for our last gem which would probably be which would theoretically be up here yep and there it is all right and down we go we got five and we got that we're good to go ah we're in we're going in here now okay okay so I'm not totally used to the swimming controls, and I really don't like the swimming controls, but at least the, the swimming controls in this game are interesting. You have to press the space bar if you're using, um, if you're, if you're using, um, gosh, the swimming controls are just horrible. But the good thing about the swimming controls is you keep your Y axis, so all you have to do is just use left and right. It's not as bad as people say it is. It just takes a while to get used to. I mean, I can understand why people would not like it, but it's not that bad. It's not that bad. The game pretty much tries to keep you... The game pretty much tries to keep you on a nice straight path, which is awesome. And um, this is this is what swimming controls back then were like, and they're they're interesting. They're interesting. I'll give them that. Got everything? Six. Yep, we got everything. Is there a secret life somewhere around here? Uh, anything? Nope. End it. <laughs> We got 13 lives. Fight, fight night with Flibby. Might as well do it. <laughs> what was that last sound? I'm trying to figure out what that last sound was all about. <laughs> All right, now we're at our boss level. So these guys are quick. These are probably just gems. They're gems. They're gems. Just gems. Gems, gems, gems. That's what we do. That's what we collect. Gems, gems, gems. Got gems, gems, gems. Oh, 
Oh, and I, I, I'm feeling right here. It looks like the, the game steers you onto the platform, so... You don't have to be very accurate when it comes to, um... When it comes to putting on the platform, because it looks like the game steers you onto the platform. We got 50 gems, we're into the boss, here we go. And I'm pretty sure that we d it's just an avoidance thing. Is it an avoid? Is it avoiding? Let's see, what are you doing? <laughs> yep. Bam! And there we go with that. Yep, he has different attacks. Now it's that, and then one last time, and we'll do that. And there we go with this boss. They're not really hard bosses, but they're pretty fun to fight. Let me, they are pretty fun. For what we had at the time, we took it. We took it. Perfect stage. 14 lives, ending this part. We will continue. We will start the special stages in the next part, part 3. But this is going by pretty nicely. This, this playthrough is going by really nicely. Yep, S2. And then here we are with the Ice of Life, the next world. But we will, we're going to start, um, we're going to start with um, the Curvy Caverns, S1. But first up, we're going to do a quick save. We're at 12%. Bam. Load game. Make sure it's good. We're at 20% right now. It's going to be 25% pretty soon because there's only four worlds. But there we go. We're at the Curvy Caverns. And I will see you for the next part.